My name is Julius Mkise. I'm uh, the head ranger of Samara Game Reserve, uh, which is situated in the Eastern Cape, in the Karoo. Part of uh, us starting the, the cheetah program is uh, we, 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 we are very much conservation minded, where we're trying to also uh, help these animals to actually make it in, in, in this wild environment. And also taking in consideration that the, the numbers of cheetahs left in, in the wild is not that great. So which pose risk of inbreeding within these animals that are left in, in, in South Africa. So what we do with the, some of the, the babies that we have is to swap with other reserves that have uh, cheetahs in the, also themselves so that we can keep the, the gene pool strong and avoid the inbreeding from, from uh, these cheetahs that we have. There's quite a few factors that cause the numbers of cheetahs to actually dwindle. Um, it's predation from bigger predators, uh, because cheetahs are not the biggest of the predators out in the wild. Uh, they're actually at the bottom of uh, the, the, the competition from all the, the lions, your leopards, hyenas, um, as well as also a uh, human factor. Uh, the cheetahs are, that are wild are still getting targeted by farmers uh, that, that will actually uh, hunt them down. So uh, that is, those are the reasons that uh, the cheetahs numbers are actually quite low at the moment. Currently uh, in the reserve, we have uh, nine cheetahs. That's uh, a good number in uh, 13,000 hectares of land uh, because you don't also want to overcrowd your, your game reserve with too many predators because you still need some of those animals to also make it. Cheetahs are actually very interesting cats uh, out in the, in the wild. They are actually one of the cats that are very docile uh, that will allow you to approach them on foot even though they've never been exposed to human contact whatsoever. Very pleasant cats. Uh, part of that also is they are not a confrontational uh, predator. And also, I mean, though they are the only cats that will be strictly diurnal, meaning that they will hunt during the day. So if they catch whatever food that they catch, nobody's going to try and steal that food from them because your lions, hyenas, leopards are all sleeping. So they can have that meal peacefully without anyone trying to steal it from them. So uh, they are quite interesting in that sense, yeah. 